Welcome back to Wild Wisdom. The Galapagos Islands, a place of unparalleled natural beauty and wonder. Just the name conjures images of giant tortoises and marine iguanas, creatures that seem almost mythical in their grandeur. This volcanic archipelago off the coast of Ecuador is a living laboratory of evolution, where the forces of nature have sculpted a unique environment. Isolated for millions of years, the islands boast a collection of plants and animals found nowhere else on Earth, each species a testament to the power of adaptation. Among the most fascinating creatures are Darwin's finches, a group of birds that helped inspire Darwin's groundbreaking theory of evolution. These finches have adapted to various ecological niches, developing different beak shapes and sizes for specific diets. Some eat seeds, others insects, showcasing nature's ingenuity. And then there's the vampire finch, a bird that defies expectations. Yes, you heard that right, a vampire finch. This bird has a unique and somewhat eerie adaptation. This remarkable bird has developed a taste for blood, a rare trait in the avian world, making it one of the most intriguing inhabitants of the Galapagos. Found primarily on the remote and rugged Wolf and Darwin Islands, the vampire finch, or Geospisa septentrionalis, is a unique bird that has developed a rather unusual feeding habit. It cuts through the skin of other birds, primarily the Nazca and blue-footed boobies, to drink their blood. These finches use their sharp beaks, which are typically used for feeding on seeds and insects, to peck at the base of the boobies' feathers until blood is drawn. It's a sight that might seem gruesome to us, but it's a fascinating example of nature's ingenuity and adaptability. But why blood, you might wonder? Why would a finch, a bird typically known for its seed-eating habits, turn to such a macabre source of sustenance? The answer lies in the harsh environment of the Galapagos Islands. The answer, as with many things in nature, lies in adaptation and survival. In times of food scarcity, these finches have adapted to exploit an available resource ensuring their survival in a challenging ecosystem. The Galapagos Islands are known for their harsh and unpredictable environment. Droughts are common, and food and water can be scarce. The vampire finch's blood-drinking habit is thought to be an evolutionary adaptation to these challenging conditions. When other food sources are scarce, blood provides a readily available, protein-rich alternative. This behavior likely developed gradually. Finches might have initially pecked at wounds or parasites on the boobies, eventually leading to the direct consumption of blood. Over time, this behavior, providing a survival advantage, became ingrained in the species. Section 4. A Delicate Balance The vampire finch's blood-drinking behavior, while seemingly parasitic, doesn't appear to harm the boobies significantly. The amount of blood consumed is relatively small and the boobies seem to tolerate the finch's presence. In fact, there's evidence to suggest that the finches might even provide a cleaning service by removing parasites from the boobies' feathers. This unique relationship between the vampire finch and the boobies is a testament to the delicate balance of the Galapagos ecosystem. It's a reminder that even in the harshest environments, life finds a way to adapt and thrive. Section 5. Symbiosis and Survival this unusual relationship between the vampire finch and the boobies might seem like something out of a horror movie, with its eerie and almost surreal dynamics. But it's a fascinating example of how species adapt to survive in challenging environments, showcasing the incredible resilience and ingenuity of nature. The finches have found a unique way to exploit a readily available resource, turning what might seem like a disadvantage into a survival strategy. While the boobies, for the most part, seem unfazed by their little bloodsuckers, they continue their daily lives with minimal disruption. This delicate dance between predator and prey, a complex interaction that balances on the edge of survival or perhaps more accurately parasite and host, reveals the intricate relationships that sustain ecosystems. It highlights the interconnectedness of life on these islands, where every species, no matter how small, has a role to play. It's a reminder that even the smallest and seemingly insignificant creatures can play a vital role in the grand scheme of nature, contributing to the delicate balance that keeps the ecosystem thriving. Section 6, A Testament to Nature. The vampire finch with its blood drinking habits might seem like a creature straight out of a gothic novel, but it's a real life example of the incredible adaptability of nature. 
In the face of adversity, life finds a way. And sometimes that way involves a little bit of blood sucking. So the next time you think of the Galapagos Islands, remember the vampire finch. It's a symbol of the island's unique biodiversity and a reminder that the natural world is full of surprises. Thanks for watching Wild Wisdom. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more amazing insights into the world of nature. Stay curious, stay wild, and we'll see you in the next adventure.